We define the pH scale to help us keep track of the concentration of acids and bases in solution. So Px stands for minus log base 10 of the concentration of x. So if we're talking about H3O+, plus, the acid form in water, then pH, which is abbreviation for H3O+, plus, is minus log of H3O+. Plus. Taking the minus logarithm allows us to look just at the exponent, essentially, for big and small numbers. So if you have a number like 10 to the minus 10, minus log of 10 to the minus 10 is 10. So you can just, instead of looking at 10 to the minus 10, you can say, what's the magnitude, the exponent? That's the logarithmic scale. It's a scale of the exponents. So if you have H3O plus OH minus in equilibrium in pure water, the concentrations are the same, and they're 10 to the minus 7th. So the pH of this solution would be pH is minus log of the H3O plus. H3O plus is 10 to the minus 7th. Minus log of 10 to the minus 7th is 7. So the pH of pure water minus log of 10 to the minus 7th, 7. If you have an acidic solution, then the H3O plus concentration is high, the OH minus is low. Remember, H3O plus and OH minus, their product must always be 10 to the minus 14th. So if H3O plus goes up, OH minus must go down. They're locked in synchrony with each other by the equilibrium of the auto dissociation of water. So H3O plus, when H3O plus concentration is high, say 1.0 times 10 to the minus 0 or 10 to the 0, that's 1. Minus log of 1 is 0. So log of a very acidic solution, high concentration of H3O plus, is 0. What if the H3O plus concentration is low? If the H3O plus concentration is low, then the OH must be high. So that's a basic solution. Here's H3O plus 10 to the minus 14th. So the pH of this solution is minus log of 10 to the minus 14, which is 14. So we have a scale based essentially on the exponents of the H3O plus concentration. 0, 7, 14, going from, ac from acidic solution, high concentration of H3O plus, to basic solution, low concentration of H3O plus. That's the pH scale.